All right. Hello, everybody, and welcome. My name is Eric, and today I'm in a place called Village Marina. It's just located on the east coast of Florida, south of Melbourne, close to the Savannah Inlet. And today I'm gonna be heading out to a island called SL8, which is that way. You guys gonna see that in a minute. And I uh, guess uh, my friend Chino Kayak is actually going to be camping the night over there. He invited me, and I agreed to do so. So this is another one of those videos where I'm making the uh, the first person point of view type of deal. You guys seem to like the last one that I made from Shell Key, so I decided to make another one. Let me see if I can get myself in here without falling into the water. And push this there. There we go. Oh yeah, like a glove. Yeah. Okay. Let me go ahead and settle in. So yeah, uh, for those of you who have seen this video before, the reason I'm making this video is to show you guys how simple it is to make these strips. Again, this is the Spoy Island located in the Indian River, SL8. There's a bunch of other ones. Once I get to the island, I'm going to shoot the drone, and you guys get to see um, all of the islands that are around that you get to choose. It's a first come, first serve type of deal, so keep that in mind. So if you choose to make the strip, make sure you get here early, especially if it's not on a on a holiday weekend, something like that. Yeah, keep that in mind, because it gets busy. But uh, although it's Easter Friday, I believe, if I'm not mistaken, it's not that busy, to my surprise, which is good. Sorry about that, it's taking longer than I expected to untangle myself. Okay, here we go. Let me go ahead and push myself out. There we go. Hi. I need to actually lift the, t the, the wheels. Yep, I need to lift the wheels. There we go. There's one. Let me get the other one. Ah, there's the other. Okay. I believe I am ready. Okay. Here we go, guys. You guys get to see everything from start to finish. <laughs> of course, I'm taking care of the boring stuff. I'm taking care of the uh, packing up and all that. Ugh get started so yeah you guys get to see everything coming out of the marina right now got my drone with me here got my tent got my chair today I'm using my uh, Saturn SK 385 XL Kaboat it's a bit more narrow um, I don't know I just felt like using this one today my other one the CK 380 is a little bigger and that one, because it's bigger, it works better with a 10 horsepower, so it, it has a hard time catching in plane. But this one, not so much. This one's pretty easy to get, you know, to get in plane with a 6 horsepower. So I brought this one with me today. One of the reasons why I like this one a lot, <coughs> even though it's a narrow cabot, the bladders are huge, which uh, mitigates the swells and waves that may come at you a lot better without you getting flipped over so easily. Yeah. Okay. I'm about to come out. I'll show you guys the island I'm gonna be going to in a minute. Once I uh, get a little, little further out. All right, 86 degrees. It's a little windy today. Uh, I think it's going to be around 10 to 20 miles per hour winds. So there might be some sound deafening on the microphone. Okay, so you see guys, you guys see that island right in front of me? That's the one. Chino Calles over there. Okay. Let me see if I can accelerate a little bit more. Got some speed. Here we go. It is so easy to catch in plane on this one. I love it. That's why I like this little boat. Here we go. I'll be there like in a couple of minutes for real. It's not that far as you can see. It's like right there. <laughs> Yippee! -de -dee!
bumpy today for sure. Whoa, whoa, whoa! <laughs> Woo! Oh yeah, it's bumpy today, all right. Oh, my butt's gonna hurt. <laughs> these trips man it's such a great adventure and the color of the water today is so emerald I love it beautiful gorgeous day for this barely any clouds it's like 86 degrees right now it's windy so it wouldn't be too hot so if I put, if I set my tent under the trees over there I'm not gonna suffer the heat at night it'll be in the 70s it's gonna be beautiful see I'm almost there I'm literally right there. Yeah, daddy! <laughs> boingy, boingy. Like before in Shell Key, when I made this first point of view video, is to show you guys a lot more details of everything that goes in on one of these trips. And most of them are easy to get to. You can pull it off on a canoe, kayak, paddleboard, jet ski, small boat, inflatable. Yeah. Many reasons to go adventuring. Let me see if Gino is in there. Yeah, he should be. I think I see his boat over there. Yeah, that's Gino and Sandy. Hey, buddy, Gino, Sandy. What's going on? Let me shut it off. Alrighty, I've just arrived. I'm recording one of those first-person point of view videos, showing everything. <laughs> All right. Well, I don't see that spot taken over there. I can probably take it. Mira, yo voy a coger, coger ese cantito que está allí. ¿Hay otro allá? Ah, oh, pues está bien. Let's do this. ¿Qué es la que es, papá? ¿Todo bien? Sacho, this is the life, papi. This is the life. I can't believe you actually got the island. Because usually the last time I came over here, it was, it was taken. ¿Había gente? Sí, la otra vez, ya, last time. I remember that. All right. Let me go park up over right here. All right, let me pull in the boat a little bit inward. That's good enough. Hey, like, hey, Bobby, what's going on, man? Yeah, it's great, buddy, my boy. Appreciate it. Hey, that's Luna. Look at you. You got all chunky. Oh, you guys should fly with me. What's going on, Luna? Look at Bingo Beefy Kid! Look at that Bingo Kid! How are you, Mama? Good. Good. It's good to see you. There she is. There she is. There's Luna. There's Luna. She's so beefy. She's like twice the size now. Last time I saw her. Look at that face. Oh, look at that face. Alright. Alright, so... ¿Cuál, ¿Cuál es el canto que puedo coger? Por allí. All right, good. All right, so I'm gonna do now. I'm gonna turn off the camera because I'm gonna go get everything set up. That's the boring stuff. Let me get the stuff ready, get it out, and I'll record some more. All right, so I'm gonna show you guys around the island a little bit. Right now, I got the drone prime because I want to show you guys this area with the drone real quick. And now this is the spot I've taken. It's already. 
here's the dock for the boat that Chino brought with him. They're set up over there with their tents. It's a neat little island, SL8. Been here a couple times already, I like it. <laughs> See, it's very nice, very spacious. Very nice. All right, time for the drone. Pica, pica los mosquitos. Pica con un disimulo. Una pica en la cara. Otra pica en el cuadro. Yo era chiquitico. Fine, right, time for drone time. Okay, let me go and grab it. Okay, there we go. Drone is free. <laughs> Alrighty. Well, I'm gonna switch you guys to the drone view right now. Here it goes. Like a bird on a tree. I'm just sitting here. I got time. It's clear to see from up here. The world seems small. We can sit together. It's so beautiful. You and me. All right, drone is back. And there we go. I'll probably shoot the drone again at nighttime. Right now, I'm just gonna chill and relax with the peeps. You know, mingle a little bit. I'll see you guys a little later uh, next year at time. I'm gonna show you guys the sunset and all that good stuff. It'll be nice and pretty. Okay, so right now we notice that the tide has go, gone down and there's a section over here which there's a sandbar that you can walk. And uh, yeah, Chino's over there. Big Bebe and her son. There's Sandy. <laughs> there's the doggy. Luna. And I wanna show you guys this because I think it's pretty cool. If you guys ever come out here, and the moment the tide goes down, you can walk this section. Yeah, a little treacherous though. If you're barefooted, there's a lot of coral over here. A lot of that sandstone. So keep that in mind. But yeah, let's walk this. <laughs> Doggy's afraid. Oh, Luna, you're doing okay? Poor Luna. Oh, goodness. Hey, you can walk this nice sandbar. It's pretty neat. Chino's over there with a net. He wants to catch some fish. I <laughs> see now it got even, even shallower here. The water's up to my knee, now it's like half there. Yep. Yep. Here it is. Free and neat, huh? Thought I'd show you guys this. I think after this, I'm gonna show you guys the sunset, nighttime, and I think I'll conclude the video with that. All right. Well, guys, it, it is almost sunset time. Look at that beautiful sunset, man. I'm telling you, that's, this is gorgeous. <laughs> and of course, like my old fashioned, I'm gonna be shooting the drone so you guys can see that from the air. Let me get to work.
that was truly a beautiful sunset. What I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna heat up some wings. I got myself some wings from Publix. I'm gonna set up my little oven. I'll show you guys that in a minute. <laughs> I'm gonna start heating up the wings. <laughs> All right, so right now I got the uh, wings heating up. It's a little square stove. It's starting to get hot. Close it up. And about, I don't know, Maybe 20 minutes, it'll be nice and hot. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna show you guys the campsite. It's starting to get dark. Got the little fire over there, and of course the wind's cooking. <laughs> no, I got you, homie. No, I got you. I can respect that, I can respect that. No, 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 okay. Yeah. You guess it, it's so good. The neighbors don't want to be recorded, I'm, and I respect that. Yeah, they're looking good, man. The ambience looks amazing. There's Miss Sandy. There's Miss Luna, right? Little Miss Attention Grabber. All attention from me. All attention from me. Hmm? Right? <laughs> so damn adorable. All right, I'm going to show you guys soon at nighttime when it's completely dark. All right. I think the oven is heating up real nicely. Oh yeah. Whoo! It's getting hot. Brandon! Almost 400 degrees. Got my own little fire going right here. I think the wings will be done in about, I don't know. Ah! Brandon! Whoo, that is cold and hot. Brandon! That'll be done in about now, 10 minutes, I think. The wings are ready. You can hear them crackling. That's nice. I'm gonna turn it off. Oh yeah. Woo! Those are ready. Time to eat. Nighttime is officially upon us. Chino got the fire started. Oh, that is awesome. That's my favorite part of camping right here, baby. <laughs> and with that, guys, I think I'm going to conclude the video. See you guys on this one.